The Academy by Noya Schuler. Hello. Why do you suppose we need an academy to tell us about bits and bitting? After all, there are many books in the uh, marketplace that tell you a lot about bits and bitting, and your trainer may know quite a bit too. You might ask them for advice. You might find, however, that sometimes your trainer says something that is different to another trainer, and you might find that what is read in one book is different to that which is read uh, in another book. And this sort of confusion in the field seems also to spill over into the web chats that you find on bits and bitting. People are desperate to know what bit they should get for their horse and then uh, many people try to advise them and there are many different views on how different bits work. And in fact, sometimes this advice is uh, not just incomplete but incorrect. And we found that there was a need to somehow gather together all the best that is known about bits and bitting and put it all in one place. So this is what we've tried to do. We've looked at the peer-reviewed literature, that is the scientific literature that is published by vets and so on in, uh, in veterinary colleges and other institutions around the world. There's been some good research and we've condensed some of that together. We've also extended some of that work by undertaking a rather more mathematical or formal analysis of the, of the subject, so we've extended it in that way. And we've also carried out our own uh, studies, experimental studies. For instance, um, the question of the absence or presence of pole pressure when rain tension is applied and whether, and whether that is a, a significant issue. So having done this, we decided that it was time to put all this together into a single place where people could come and study the subject in a rather more formal environment and get answers that are not now just the subject of a, a matter of opinion or perhaps just carried through from some half-remembered uh, uh, training that, that somebody has had and carried through uh, to you, but to put down the facts so that there are a, a certain set of indisputable um, issues that can be learnt about bits and bitting from which people can go forward to try to understand why the bit works in a certain way in the horse's mouth. Let me just give you one example of something that you can learn in the academy. It turns out that when you apply rein tension as you ride your horse, the bit rotates in the horse's mouth into an angle which remains fixed for most riding situations. We've analysed this in some detail, let me show you how that is. If we take this line here as the line down the horse's tongue, which is almost parallel to the horse's nose, we can call this line the tongue line, TL. Now when you take a, a contact on the reins, the mouthpiece rotates into um, an angle such that the bore axis, which is the hole in the end of the mouthpiece through which maybe the loose ring goes, that bore axis rotates into a fixed alignment to the tongue. So we can draw that as a line across here. We call that the bore axis BA. Now this remains fixed. And the angle that you can put between these two lines, theta, which is the Greek letter theta, which is often used for angles, we call this the working angle, WA. Now this concept of the working angle is very important because it means, for the first time, we can analyse bits through simple photographs and work out quite simply what is pressing on your horse's tongue and what is pressing on the horse's lips as you ride with one bit or another bit. And you can learn all of this through one of the modules in the, in the Academy. So hopefully the riding public and you will join us and enrol on one of our courses and enjoy learning about bits and bitting from a rather more informed perspective one based on physics and engineering. The courses are quite accessible. They are somewhat mathematical in the later stages, but in the early stages you need to have no mathematical experience whatsoever. There are no acad minimum academic entry requirements, so it really is accessible to everybody. And you can enrol by going to the website, and we hope to see you soon and enjoy working with you to learn more about this subject. So please join us in the Academy. Thank you. 
For further information about the Academy by Neue Schule, please visit www.nsbits.com forward slash academy.